After downloading DaVinci Resolve and installing it, just go ahead and open it. And you're going to be presented with a, uh, this screen that have the users. So they have the admin user, the guest user, and you can create a new user. And you can later add more users from this button. Now go ahead and create your new user. I'll click on set up my account. I'll just add a new username and set up new user. Now go ahead and click on the new user. Now this is the new user project screen. It will have all the projects created by this user. This is where uh, you can add new folders and this is where you create new projects. And this is where you choose how to display your projects. Let's go ahead and create a new project. Let's double click on the new project. And now this is DaVinci Resolve. DaVinci's interface is basically five different interfaces. You have the media, edit, color, gallery, and delivery. Let's start with the media button. Media is where you actually get your films to be colored. This is where you import all your media. Edit is obviously for editing. Um, the thing is DaVinci is not a full editing environment at the moment, but Blackmagic is trying to push more and more editing features of DaVinci with every new version. At the moment, this is where you import your EDLs coming from other uh, softwares like Premiere or uh, Final Cut. Then to the color, tab okay this is where all the magic happens color tab is the place where you completely change the look of your footage then to the gallery tab the gallery tab is where you get your color references uh, and you store your looks then we have the delivery tab uh, which is basically the render uh, tab where we export our films and our footage we have a lot of different options here that we're going to go through later